is going to be an even number. Now let's say someone gets really, really hungry and they decide to come and take these away from me. Now I have this much. I'm not sure how many because I haven't counted yet and I need to decide if it's an even or odd number. Once again, I'm going to try to put them into pairs. So I already have this pair. Then I'm going to take these two and put them into a pair. And then I'm going to put this one into a, wait, I can't put this piece of candy into a pair. There's not another piece of candy to put it with. Since I cannot put this into another pair, I realize that this is an odd number. I cannot pair this number. So one, two, three, four, five is an odd number. I have two here, two here, and one all by itself. Five is an odd number. Let's take a look at this whiteboard and see how many even or odd magnets we have. <coughs> Wait, I can't move these magnets, it's too strong. It looks like we're going to have to think of another way to figure out the even and odd numbers. I have an idea. I can put them into pairs by adding a circle around twos when we find twos. Let's do that together. Let's look at this top row right here and count how many magnets we have. Here's one, two, three, four. Let's go ahead and put them into pairs. This is a pair, and this is a pair. So four is an even number because it can be put into equal pairs. Let's look at the next row. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six. Some of you are probably already catching on and you can tell right away. Is this an even or odd number? Well, let's see. Let's put these into pairs and figure out if this is going to be even or odd. Let's circle these two and these two and these two. Look, if you said even, then you are right because they can all be put into pairs. Great job. There are six magnets here that can be put into pairs, which makes six an even number. Now let's look at this last row. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go ahead and put these into pairs to see if we have an even or odd number. Let's put these two together, and these two together, and these two together, and uh-oh, we can't put this into a pair because there's not another magnet to pair it with. Right away, we should recognize that this is going to be an odd number. We realize we can't put it with anything else, so 7 is an odd number. <laughs>